Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'll be taking you through an exercise on Generative Shade Metal Workbench in Kitsiavi 5. So we are on the third part of our tutorial series and here we are going to work on the wall on edge and which in that we'll be working on the sketch based feature. So the first thing you need to do is to create a sketch on this particular thickness right here which we would be using on the wall on edge tool and we need to do the sketch of this particular portion here so to do that just rotate it and uh, come to this particular view and use the profile tool and start creating a profile just go ahead and uh, create a sketch which will resemble whatever we need to create now make sure you are creating the horizontal and vertical lines and wait until it, the line tur turns blue that's not a vertical line Else you can just leave it like that connect it and take the constraint select the line make it vertical select the line make it horizontal select the line and make it vertical all right now we have all HV 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 here and coincide this line with this line same way coincide this edge with this line and the next thing you could do is to input a length for this as 10 and then this length as 9 you can see a chamfer over here you could have just closed this and given the chamfer later also you can give the chamfer now as 6 into 45 degrees so you can give the length of this edge as 6 and the angle of this as 45 degrees this particular length is 40 just take that just input it as uh, 40 here and this one is 19 and the total height from this edge to this line is 43 which you can see and now you're done with the sketch the next thing you need to do is to exit the sketch and then invoke the tool so you can see here this is a clearly a wall on edge situation here you can see the from the top you can see this edge here so just go for wall on edge insert walls and wall on edge and select the sketch base feature and then select this as your profile and just hide your sketch and select this as your edge alright now just go through all the uh, different options and click on OK and you get the wall on edge over there so we are almost done with our uh, shape metal component and we have completed the third part of our tutorial series and if you have any doubt on this particular part just comment below the video and I'll be getting in touch with you if you have uh, any CAD related projects you could write to me at ketia.prototuser at gmail.com with necessary attachments thank you so much for watching and stay tuned